The NBA hotline has been put to good use, much to my surprise, and Twitter thinks they know who's responsible for most of the calls. Hey guys, it's Devin Howard. If you're not following me on Instagram, you should. I'm there as at Devin Howard. Subscribe to the Fumble, tap the bell for notifications, and give this video a thumbs up. In order to keep the NBA as safe as possible, they established an anonymous hotline where players could call and tattle on their teammates and opponents without disclosing their identity. It's something that I really did not anticipate these athletes taking advantage of. I thought that they would kind of all follow bro code and not want to rat each other out. But I was so wrong, you guys. According to Shams, multiple tips have been placed into the hotline to report protocol violations in Orlando. Shams said that some players have received warnings from violations. He added that the league is ensuring social distancing and mask protocols in the bubble, which tells me that most of the hotline tips have been about players walking around without a mask or standing too close to one another. I mean, this seems like a pretty minor offense. I mean, I know they're not supposed to be walking around without masks or standing within six feet of each other, but it just seems kind of like a big deal to call a tip line just to report something like that. So of course, Twitter got to work trying to figure out who was making that hotline bling, and of course, the belief is that Chris Paul is at the center of it. People were tweeting things about the snitch line operators getting tired of CB3's calls, and him reviewing the surveillance cameras and calling out whoever goes to get Postmates. This one shows a picture of Chris on his phone with the caption, yep, Buena Vista Drive, walked across the road and everything. One guy said that Chris really needs a hobby, while another noted that the tipster's name is Iskra Alpa and they left 99% of the phone tips. But of course, some people joked that LeBron would be riding Kawhi out. So guys, if you're gonna be around CP3, wear your mask, keep your distance, and most of all, tuck in your shirt. Are you surprised that these athletes are making use of the tip line? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and tap the bell. I'm Devin Howard for The Fumble, and I'll see you later.